yeah. because I incepted that they could learn through the cameras. And mm -hmm. nobody who's studying with me this way says, I don't know, this is just not a very effective way of learning. I don't hear that ever. Everybody's mm -hmm. just like, oh my God, just totally blown away that this works. And I go, okay, yes, I need 20 more students. I need 100 mm -hmm. more students. And they go, but then you can't answer all of our questions. And I'm like, but I could stream to 10,000 people and alter the fucking industry. Mm -hmm. And they go, what? Not, you're not making any sense. Like you're not, <laughs> you're not working within normal parameters. And I'm like, I know I got the internet now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like, yeah. well, I still do hands on. Sure. Will we still do retreats in Costa Rica. Well, hopefully, you know, will mm -hmm. I still do online apprenticeships in various ways, one-on-one -on -one and small group. Yeah. Like just add more offers and continuing serving. Yep. student needs and then i yeah. go cool like i'm going to help the students focus on the body work how do you do that offer them a business subscription we'll, we'll produce three videos a week that'll come out on your social media as long as you give us bulk footage and i'm like yeah. ah now we're <laughs> yeah. now we're putting it together in a way that yeah. it would there's some manual labor involved, but you're farming it out and then you're outsourcing the labor component to be able mm -hmm. to get their business to start to wind. Mm -hmm. Yep. But yeah. yeah, still being told, you can't learn online. I'm like, <laughs> well, y'all certainly know how to complain online. We figured that out. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Gosh, I honestly, I, I prefer it. Like, I mean, it's nice to get in, you know, in the same room with other massage therapists because we're often one on one with one person, you know, in, in a room <laughs> quietly, you know, giving treatment or whatever. Um, but the online, like I can use my office, my things. I'm in my comfort zone. I have all of my tools and all of my whatever. And it's my setup. I don't like it. I don't know. It's just it, easy. I can ask you accessible, yeah. affordable. Yeah. The other totally. piece, and I, I didn't catch this because I, I cut my teeth teaching group classes. Mm -hmm. One of the things that I was shocked by was even through the cameras, people were learning three times as fast one on one. Mm -hmm. And this wasn't like I could see it in their work because we're on video. Like I, you know, see your development as we continued working. Mm -hmm. And then I mm -hmm. go, why the one on one? Like, why do I not see that same development in a group class? And I think what it is, is one, it like gets me a chance to meet you right where you are to answer a question, mm -hmm. but it's every month. Mm -hmm. I've talked yeah, to lo local students in Austin, uh, Kristen and Danielle taught a table class and I said, Hey guys, listen, I got an idea. We've met for this one class. I'd like to meet with you once a month for an additional two to three hours mm -hmm. so we can and they're like oh that sounds that's a really time consuming but if you want to get honestly if you want to get good at what you do you have you can't just take a class and yeah. and then just like because i i have my own personal experience the way i do mat massage now is so different from when i first started like just back last february it's, it's, I'm better at it. I, I'm more confident in it. I, I know different places to go. And that's just because I just keep kept doing it. I kept, you know, meeting with you once a month and, um, and then bring whatever we learned into, uh, my, my weekly clients. And yeah, like <laughs> you can't just take a class and then just not practice. Cause then you don't, I don't know. I, I've taken a lot of I'm classes. I'm an educator. And and I'm yeah. only like, I don't have any training in educational theory, but yeah. I have learned over time that I like group trainings less than one-on-one, mm -hmm. -on -one, even over the cameras. Mm -hmm. And I also found it more emotionally satisfying because it was, it was like beating your head against a brick wall for 10 years where it was like, I taught a hundred group classes in Austin and I'm like, where are the students going? They just take a mm -hmm. class and then vanish. Mm -hmm. It wasn't having a, a discernible effect on the marketplace. Whereas when I kept working with you month after month after month, 
and you're like, all of a sudden, this is the thing, again, I can't learn online. You hear this 10% noise in the background, and I'm like, well, Michelle certainly can, because she's in Canada, and we've never met in person, and her entire practice is mat-based with suspension. Mm -hmm. and they go, huh? But, oh, Easy, yeah. affordable, accessible. Who's going to yeah. argue about that? I don't want it to yeah. be easy, affordable, and accessible. Yeah. And yeah. I, no, they're like, I want hands-on. I'm like, oh, here it is. It's robertsmagictouch.com. It's right here. <laughs> like, if you live in Austin, you can just come train with me. Yeah. And then locally, they go, oh, but it's, like, really expensive. And I'm like, dude, do you know what, like... <laughs> There's a reason there's a reason I live in an apartment and not a home. It's like because you can't mm -hmm. afford to buy here because the real estate values have gone through the roof. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stuff is expensive. 